I'm here in Hollywood right now having coffee and also my breakfast burrito and today we're gonna do a hundred dollar vacation budget here in Los Angeles let's see if we can do it it's a bit challenging here's the list of the most expensive cities in the world and Los Angeles ranks sixth we have already spent eight dollars for our breakfast burrito and three dollars for our coffee it's the cheapest breakfast burrito I could find here Egg talk is really good because normally breakfast burrito would cost here $13 to $15 but this is humongous and it's only 8 bucks. I thought the cheapest coffee in Starbucks is an Americano. I actually prefer Americano but we are on a budget today so we will... Oops! It almost spilled. We're having brewed coffee which is also great and it's only $3. For today's video, we will have a $100 vacation budget here in Los Angeles for the entire city. Can we do it? Let's find out. And off we go. I see some girl shopping over there. They're trying to have a picture with the Hollywood sign right there. I bet you playing that cornhole is free. From here, we're gonna ride the Big Bucks tour to see the entire city. Let's see how much that is and if it's within our budget. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. It's forty-eight dollars weekday, but weekend is gonna be fifty-four dollars. Can I see it in front? Thank you. There's the blue route which goes to the beach. I want to finish first the red route which is a two hour tour all over. Then we'll transfer to the blue route which goes to the beach. right there. Here is the Academy Museum. I've been here as well. If you like film, this is the place to be. The greatest movies of all time. Star Wars is here. This is the Tar Pits. Very interesting site. Here you can see old archaeological stuff like dinosaurs, saber tooth. It's about 12 noon. I'm supposed to be hungry, but I'm still not hungry. So before heading to the farmer's market, let's check out the grove first. Where is it? Here? Uh, whoa! Nice! 
This is definitely out of our $100 budget today, but I just couldn't believe it. How much was it? $61.5. That's fully loaded. Not bad. That's not bad. The Model <laughs> X is 80000 right? Wait. How do you close it? Oh, it doesn't... It doesn't sink. Thank you for me riding me down. I hope you enjoy your first ride of the trolley, big boy. Never seen anyone polish here. The Grove is one of my favorite pit stops because it has the best loo. I'm actually in one right now, so you could see it's kind of fancy, right? It's time to explore the farmer's market. The most popular place here if you don't know about it both tourists and locals enjoy this place because I must admit they are good I don't think we have time to eat in there but in case you're here this is a really good place LA is just super busy today I queued for this but I save a lot but I know I can only take one and then this is just six dollars. Oh, wow, this dog looks so cute. I was thinking of having a small dessert here because it's within our budget but I have to prioritize the bus schedule and it's coming soon so I better be at the pickup right now. Oh no, okay. <laughs> here from where we started the Hollywood one and our goal is to hop on the blue route this thing just started working I can actually hear something right now two in the afternoon right now I'm having matcha and coffee because I'm craving for something that will wake me up I'm getting sleepy they're kind of famous celebrities go to this ranch but I don't think we will arrive in Santa Monica for sunset oh my gosh I really want to have a sunset there because the bus that I was waiting for is not functional here you can see this other blue line is still at the beach area this other blue line is that's just how vacations are you don't know you can't predict it we only have one bus and I don't know what time is coming there to pick us up I thought the other one is in service it's only his break and now maybe we can catch the sunset Just in case you're trapped here for sunset, you can take bus number four and I'm sure it's like about a dollar. There's just a lot of people right now. Well, I didn't even know there's a carousel in Santa Monica. Yeah, I'm getting like my third try. <laughs> I swear. 
I know, it's like, it's like hella cute too. Like, I'm so happy. Congratulations! Thank you. 30 seconds! You won a small prize! Keep holding on to win a bigger prize! Holy smokes! One minute! the big bus tour. I do think it's worth it, especially if you're a tourist here or even a local just for fun. If you take an Uber here, going one way from Hollywood to Santa Monica will already cost you $50 or more. If you get a car and you are a family of four, I think renting a car is worth it. But if you can't drive here in Los Angeles, which could be ruthless, I highly suggest the big bus tour. I haven't experienced their competition, so I can't say how good it is, but I'm glad that big bus tour has an app that I can track so I know where the buses are. Let me tell you a little bit about street performers here in the Santa Monica Pier. So from 11.30 a.m. down below, any performer can perform here. But after 11.30 a.m., only licensed performer can perform here. But still, not everyone who has license can come here and perform. In the morning, they do a lottery, and whoever wins the lottery can go to one of the stars. It's not every day that they can have money, so they really have to hustle when they come here. That's why I chose to give the $20 to a performer. Well, it's actually $25 because they deserve it. <laughs> you already know that I appreciate you and thank you so much. I'd love to read your comments if you have suggestions, questions, or stories you want to tell me. See you next time and off I go.